Damn, son. This is the first zombie I've ever seen do that before. Did I make a friend, guys? Oh my god. I think I made a friend. I've never seen this before. Alright, day 12, night, going to day 13, coming up. So, as we logged off last time, we logged off in the warehouse, so I wanted to see. Locks on, locks on. What kind of health? Same health. 198. I just put that lock on, so I got two health off somehow. Um, I wanted to see if I logged off in here, if any zombies would actually spawn, which they had been spawning in here, but never really slept in here, but it's our first night sleeping in the room. I'll take a card. What else I see? The long oil filter. Oh yeah, we had a uh, we had plans to go to uh, get that uh, the RV. We're getting the RV today. I need some tinder and some firewood to get this. Uh, we need to go ahead and make this fire pit while we're at it. See if we can grab some firewood from this. Nope. Oh, one of these barrels has to have some firewood. Yes, sir. Ah, oh, shit. Settle down now. Simmer down now. Simmer down. Ah, oh, dang it. I can't carry the firewood. Too heavy. Clear so far. Let me just run in and throw something. Shit, see, now that's what I'm talking about. How you going... I mean, yeah. See, that's what that's one of the things that I'm kind of disappointed about in the game is the the spawns, man. Like I, I walked away from my own house, I come back, and the damn warehouse is riddled with zombies. You're just making me waste my ammo here. Where'd you come from, dude? Anybody want to explain where he spawned from? Right now I just like to see if I can spot the, uh, the RV. I guess while I'm over here uh, scavenging some food, which uh, we're at 81 pounds. So if we just go on a food run, RV's gone. RV was there. I guess we'll probably just ditch the idea of the RV. But right now. I mean, that may actually... We may actually get enough to uh, get our hunger all the way up. Rancid chicken. All right, we're gonna leave you. Uh, leave that rancid. Oh shit! Cons oh no! Whew. Almost consumed the rancid chicken. Did I? Did I eat the rancid chicken? No. No, how come every other time if I click on the menu, it, it just closes the action out, but it made me eat the ranch of chicken. All right. All right, STN, that was uh, not cool, bro. I wasn't hoping for sickness. 
Sickness was not part of the plan. We just got to figure out how we're going to cure sickness. I know I've got like some antibiotics. And I had something else. I think it was antiseptic though. Antiseptic ain't going to cure what I eat. The antibiotic might. Alright, let's take one antibiotic. Okay, let's see. Helps fight sickness. So, we have the antibiotic. Let's use it. Probably decrease the uh, thirst, the hydration. So a decrease in calories. So let's uh, let's eat up real quick. Just in case we got a door camper. Should we run through the police station. Let's do it. I don't want to go through that one room. gun jam there. another pump like all we're gonna get from here I was hoping for some ammo scared the hell out of me talk about a jump scare Ooh. I felt that shit run through my bones good grief man go dang Woo. all right so let's equip this wood axe and chop this tree down We have logs. All right, so let's take uh, take one log. Then let's take uh, the draw knife. I don't know if we need this to make uh, planks. One log gives eight planks. I'm guessing I'm going to need hammer and nails. Hammer, nails. And with hammer and nails, can I take the planks? 
worn plank. How can I make a better plank? Q. There we go. Worn plank, plank. It's doing quite good right now. I'm liking it. Oh, yeah. I need to start, not start in the middle. There we go. And can you put them on both sides? Yes, you can. There we go. Right here. All right, so now we need to get a lock kit. Get this door locked. We can get this airlock secure. We got two locks on this. We'll get one more. That way, we'll at least have two doors to have to go through. I'll feel a little bit safer. Alright, we're at 2,200. We got 110 pounds we can carry, boys. 2,200 cows a day. Shouldn't be too hard. Is it worth playing Survive the Nights in the current state? Yes. Yes. Let me tell you something, Z. It's, uh... Dude, it's... it's I'd say almost 100% optimized game. It is so far... Like, almost perfection. I mean, there's still some updates to come and uh, a, just a very, very minor bug fixes. But other than that, everything is working perfect. I mean, I'm not sure if you played it in its uh, original release status, but uh, oh man, I'm talking about night and day, night and day. If you wonder why I'm eating all this food right now, at the end of every day in the morning, your calories reset to zero. And right now it's 2,200 calories, 1,700 calories is what I have in me. But if I can reach the uh, 22 max and go over it or stay at it, then my overall health will actually increase. When overall health increases, it means me, uh, right here, the current maximum capacity, 110 pounds. If you don't have enough calories, see this right here overall health will remain the same now watch this if you don't have enough calories your health will decrease and now my overall health will increase in the morning so i'm not sure what the max out weight is on the maximum uh capacity right here but i can carry more when it uh increases all right let's do this let's go out and uh let's go to the city i haven't ran into too many players uh, we had some player action the other night, uh, and the guy actually logged from me. So, I was hoping for a little gunfight, but uh, it is what it is. I can't tell you how the KOS is on the game. I know they are uh, there is a mental state in the game, so killing other players uh, will affect your mental state. Not quite sure what effect that will have. Um, but that's an interesting thing. We'll learn more about that as we play through the game. Uh, but uh, right now we're searching for locks and lock kits so we can secure our warehouse a little bit more. Every building is securable to put uh, padlocks on the doors, padlocks on already pre-chests that are in the house. Uh, you can use stores for every cabinet, every pretty much every object in the house, desks, cabinets, uh, refrigerators, whatnot. Uh, you have multiple vehicles. I've seen this car, and there are RVs. I really want to find another RV and uh, get it going to get it. I can actually have space in my warehouse. So electricity is in, so the electricity is working great. You need a generator. 
Uh, some circuit breakers, electrical cord. Uh, some alternators, or I think you need an alternator. No, you don't. I'm not sure if you need an alternator or not, but uh, yeah, you can do electricity, which then uh, powers like garage doors, uh, lights. But yeah, one of the main reasons, I mean, I'm enjoying the game, but one of the main reasons I'm streaming the game, I mean, it does have a couple thousand followers, so hopefully the followers of the game see more people streaming the game and actually come and check it out and uh, decide to purchase and get to playing. So I think I've already had two people so far who have bought the game just on watching me play it, so. Oh, cool. cool. Yeah, I followed for a long time and decided to try it out after the uh, Alpha 1 update. And again, I've been very pleased. Very pleased. <laughs> We're in the hardware store. Uh, lock kit. That is a. Uh... Aw, oh, man, don't tell me the lock kit just. I speak all out of there it is okay I thought it disappeared I was about to say I speak all the this good of the game and then I show you a bug right there on the spot we've already got a combo lock back at the crib so I was really in search for that lock yet that's a big find are there any plans to make the zombie harder to kill I I'm not sure about plans to make the zombies harder to kill it's just I mean in the beginning well this bat that I've got it uh I've got, I got nails in it, so it's an upgraded bat. Uh, most zombies take, I mean, a shotgun, one shot's going to take them. Sometimes two shots take them. But uh, sometimes with a regular bat, it's going to take three hits. I mean, if you get more than one on you, it's a little bit harder to kill them. But in the beginning, when you're basically searching for guns, ammo, and good melee weapons, it's, it's, it's a lot tougher. But like I said, I'm on going on day 14, which is like 14 hours into this life. Uh, it's not so hard. During the daytime, at least. I'm trying to reverse. But nighttime, man. When you got groups of five. If you play it smart and just kind of let one aggro on you at a time, it's a lot easier just to take one at a time. But when you got swarms of them, it, there's no melee. You're not going to be able to survive with just a melee weapon. You have to use guns. And of course, the shotgun's going to give you, what, six shots? And then you got to sit and reload. So I've got an AR, but 5.56 ammo is kind of scarce on me right now. That's my favorite. Best gun on the game. I think they should make zombies harder to kill with melee weapons. Yeah. Either that or make sure that, that head hits will take one or two. The body hits take less. So far, it's easier just to go ahead and aim for the body because it takes just about as much. And it's a, a bigger area to work with. Like either you're suggesting making uh, zombies harder to kill or as you progress further in the game... Uh, they get harder. I mean, seven days to die did that, and you know the first seven days aren't so hard. I mean, you get up to like you know day 50, day 60, and they start taking a whole lot, a whole lot more wax to take them out. A lot more ammo you got to use to take them too. But so far, day 14 is about just as many hits as uh, day one. Uh, seems that uh oh look I left with all my locks unlocked not smart gun jam me messing up my wood I just put that there fool I don't appreciate that. Yeah, I done broke one of my planes. Little bastard. 
settle down now. Golly. Hey, when you got ammo, it's not too bad to take them out. But that gum. They will mess your shit up. I hope you guys are enjoying the game. And I really hope this game, uh, game persuades you to uh, jump in and play it. Because, uh, like I said, it's optimized and ready to play. Ready to roll. As you can tell, I had not had much problems with running or doing anything so far. So, so far, so good. Love this game, dude. How are you? And boarded up for a night already. <laughs> yes, I am boarded up. And uh, as you say that, I'm about to... Let's see. I'm about to put a little bit more fortification. So it takes a screwdriver, lock kit, and a combo lock. And I've got lock here, lock here. And we're just going to go ahead and uh, stick one more lock on this door. Or should we... Yeah. We'll do that. Let's reset. Fourteen. See, let's see. You must enter the correct code for locking it can be reset. Okay. Good luck. I always risk it for the biscuit and end up dead. I need to be. Yeah, patience is uh it's something you do have to have. This game needs more streamers. I hope it gets big so we can build a nice community. Me too. Me too. I greatly enjoy it. That's why I really like uh, streaming it. Like I was saying earlier, I don't like streaming anything that I don't like. And like I said, I'm not a big streamer, so you can guarantee I'm not trying to stream something just to get views. This is right here. I'm streaming to show the community that the game is ready. I enjoy it, and I want to get more people playing it. So that's my end goal. That is my end goal. All right, so we're all this is gonna go to zero as soon as daylight comes. Uh, so let's have we've got food. We're gonna eat. We'll drop off what excess amount of food we have, and then we'll go out for the day. Okay. Well, we got us an achievement. Two weeks down. All right. So as I said before, at the beginning of each day. Your calories decrease to zero. And if I do not get that up to 2400, my overall health decreases because of calories. That states why. So, that being said, we'll eat and then we'll go out. We're going to the old town. Head on down to the old town road. Chicken. Ooh. I don't prefer to uh, drive in the city and announce my presence. I'm not quite sure how far you can actually hear that car off, but I like to be somewhat incognito. Let's go ahead and deal with this guy before he becomes a problem. fire going down there I don't remember going wasn't going last time I was down here really wish I would have brought my AR with me as long as I see zombies in the houses I know nobody's held up in there so What we're trying to do is get to the uh, to the hardware store. I seen. I think it was a zombie down there. 
free roamer. Let's uh let's check that out before we go in here. You can't be too careful. I mean, I thought it was a zombie, but I sure did dip behind that uh, church kind of quick. All right, we just need to get closer to the church. Ain't no need in flanking around it because we don't have no long range weapon. Not to say it didn't run off. Check these bushes. All right. I know I saw something, dude. That was very weird. I'm still going to take it as if I'm not alone, so... There's zombies inside here, so... I know if there is a player, then it's not in this church. Let's see what else is searching here. Can't play the piano? We got some food. Well, that's one reason. That'd be a good thing. It's actually a... Probably be a pretty good place as a defensive hold down. But as far as... I mean, there ain't... Ain't crap for storage in here, but there's a big guy in there. See the door open, but there's a zombie inside, so there will be nobody in that house. Well, a shotgun, one shot a player. I would say it just depends on health. Um, a shotgun ain't going to one shot. I'm not sure if you're like super, super, super close and take a headshot. But it's definitely not going to one shot. I mean, if I'm like uh, this close on you and shot you in the head, I can't confirm that. But, uh,. Alright, we're just going to go all out. Maybe we'll get some, uh, get some attention and somebody will come. Ah, shoot. <clears throat> we draw attention, so be it. Another combo lock. I really want lock kit. spark plugs see the long wall filter here, before I even do that let me get back here generally you could take a uh, a gun and take the long wall filter and attach it but as far as uh, I think the only thing you can attach to this uh, shotgun is the flashlight So we got us a combo lock and a lock kit. That's what we was looking for. Almost passed it up. Almost. Go ahead and grab the jerry can as well. That's really all we was looking for in this city, so. Uh, there are snipers in the game. Uh, if you've got an AR, 
and you have a site or you, there's Clinchesters, there are 308s. Uh, and if we're talking as far as being able to snipe, or you, yeah, you can definitely snipe in the game. I didn't know if you meant that or stream sniper. <laughs> Alright, so this was a successful run. We got exactly what we come after. Just want to peek and see if anybody's following me. Nope, yep, we're good. Seems like Old Town's quiet. All right, let's head back for nighttime. What's your favorite food uh, that I can? What's your favorite food that I can feed you? Uh, well, if you're feeding me, oh, make it a medium rare steak, my friend. Don't forget the A1. I don't care how good your steak is. I love good steak. It could be the best, but God dang it, I like uh, as I like to say, I like a little bit of steak with my A1. <laughs> kappa kappa. Trying to get back good on uh, my 556 five, so I can uh, use my AR some more. Always gut your car. If you want to keep your car, gut your car. You want to give somebody a car and expect it to be gone, leave it there. All right, so. Get that locked, too. We are we're pretty secure, man. I mean. I'd say we're very secure, to be honest with you. Move some of this cardboard. You hear that chicken? Almost sound like a dead chicken, hollering for its life. The machete so far is like my first, uh, my my go-to uh, melee weapon. A lot, it's a lot of one uh, one one shots with the uh, machete, but my machetes are pretty damn dull. And even with the sharpening stone, and we're gonna try this again real quick just to prove this to the world. Let's grab that and a machete. And we'll even go over here. Great. Shop. See? Combat knife, hatchet, and wood axe. But it's stated up here. When I had that, when I found that machete, or quite a few of them, it says that it can be sharpened with the sharpening stone. Now, if any of you guys know that if I'm doing something wrong, or for some reason y'all have sharpened the machete, please let me know. But other than that, this is all it's letting me sharpen. And it sharpens the wood axe good. I went from a 6% up to 100 and sharpening something, so I know the sharpening stone works. It's just not working on the machete, in which it states that it will. So, that be the case, I hope that gets fixed, and I need to save this battery. Let's we'll see where we're in the headlamp. Uh, I still got 79%, so that's really not bad. Let's turn it on so you guys can see what I'm seeing. Because I know the stream gets pretty dark. The gamma is pretty low. It's probably not a thing right now. Yeah. It may not be a thing, but it, it it still does state when you get that machete that it can be sharpened with a stone. So I'm I'm wanting to sharpen a dig on machete because it's so good. Um, baseball bats are great. Even if you got a 2% bat, put some nails in that bad boy. It will get to 100. And it, it's a great... Uh, melee weapon. Got an extra uh, T5. Got a Bateman the Clinchester. I mean, we got ammo for days. So I'm not worried about ammo. The main ammo I'm after is 5.56, in which we have about 40 rounds. 
but I'd like to save up on that. As soon as uh, I spawned in the game, I legit couldn't see anything because it was so dark. Thought my game had just crashed. Yeah, as soon as you spawn in, the good thing about as soon as you spawn in, you do have a headlamp that you can use. Uh, I think the keybind, I never changed my keybind, so smack the V button and uh, turn that bad boy on and you can see. But if you're spawning in at nighttime and you basically only have your hands, uh, unless you're like Deontay Wilder and you got one and one hit power to knock them out then i don't think it's gonna happen i've died the same way quite a few times at night time smaller than so my scary ass just find a little bush and hide in it or if you can only get in if you spawn near a house you can get to that house and just take out the zombies that are inside uh go for it and if you got a fire go ahead and start that fire up inside that house and sit near it so you can uh, get your health back up i know when i started uh the thing i was doing that i was screwing up on was i was predominantly going around looking for clean rags uh just so i could make bandages so i could heal until i found out that just standing by a fire actually gets your health back up so that was probably the best thing that i learned as as a new player was hey man stand by the fire it brings your health up but yeah i was like i would find a clean rag and i'm like praise god there's a clean rag i can make a bandage all right as we all know at the beginning of the day it is food time i really like to have enough food to go ahead and get me the next day so i don't have to look every single day and you know just give me a two day span that gives me what two hours i think let's go uh let's go hunt some deer hey another big one um don't forget like when you're in this uh when you're in your menu your shift button your shift button is going to change things hey what happened shit just turned on a sticky key uh but yeah shift we'll change that from place to drop uh create I don't think it does much in create but uh yeah like if you're placing something on there you gonna drop it you can be close to it and drop it and it'll go on the thing uh but i like to be uh very particular on how i place my objects because i have dropped something and it's went down and went through the ground but i've also placed things and it's went through the grate and disappeared but uh either or let's eat up so we can uh go do some hunting today all right i know the perfect place for hunting some deer Hell, there's chicken all over the place. Huh. There's one right there. All right, usually, uh, like, as soon as we get up here to the uh, cabins, and then we take out left, and we go in that first big S curve, in that field, I'm, there's usually, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and say, I'm, I'm going to say five there. Maybe four. But, uh, never, nonetheless, there will be deer. Look at that. One, two, three, four, five, six. I didn't expect anybody to really even uh, come on your channel. Right, let's see how far we can get up on these bad boys. Is there a bullet drop? Because if not, that should have been right in the head. Ah, shit. I got one hit. Two hit. Am I just that bad? Did I get him? I know I hit him. Alright, that's dead on. That's one. There's two. Let's try it. Try to shoot the same guy. I mean, that's a... Well, somebody stay still. I'll tell you what, let's go skin this guy, see how much the weight is on the meat. It's not that I'm that bad of a shot. I mean, you're right here in front of me, and this right here is going to be straight head. That is in the head. You can see the blood. I send a head to you. 
I have uh, 600 hours of rust, but you need to try hard, and there's only PvP. True, true, true. Yeah, that's true. I love Call of Duty. I can never stream it because it's so popular. I won't get any viewers. Yeah. You're not going to get any viewers. I, I mean, I mean, look, 60,000, 70,000, 120,000 people are watching, you know, Dr. Disrespect, in which I go to watch Dr. Disrespect. If Dr. Disrespect is streaming a game, I'm not definitely going to stream that game for viewers. So. Dr. D, if you're watching, you are the man. Love Dr. Disrespect. Being not er this is game is in such early stages, man. So, this game, like, has so much potential. Like, so much. Like, it's really gonna go somewhere. I'm telling you, it is. It was meant to go somewhere from the get-go. It was just a lot of work that needed to be put into it. And, uh, it's getting the full attention and the updates that it deserves. That was in the neck. That was in the ass. So was that. Unless this thing does have bullet drop. I really haven't shot long distance to know whether it does or not. But we're going to pop this dude right in the butt cheeks. Got him. Oh, it's a spot. It was not falling. He's spotted. How many points is that? Okay, inventory full can only take four. So, dear meat. Right, we got plenty of food. If you join their Discord, there's feedback. I mean, you can give feedback, suggestions. Uh, the devs are active in there. They listen to you. They respond to you. The community is great. So, I mean, play the game. If there's bugs, let them know. I mean, they're, I mean, they're here to make our lives better in the game. There's nothing greater than playing a game in which the makers will listen to your suggestions, take them into consideration, and uh, fix what needs to be fixing. <laughs> There's my first car. That one right there on the rocks. Trying to drift in. Didn't work too good. Where can I find the map? Uh, look, look right here. Did you see that? You see that thing back here? You see the green building? The bus stop? Here, I'll even drive back so you can see a good picture of it. You'll see these all over the place. That right there. If you go in that bus stop and search that little blue uh, cage right there, the stand, 99.9999999999% uh, of the time, you're going to find a map right there. Always, guaranteed. And plus, if you need to log off, you can actually hit that bench up and log off and uh, respawn there if you need to, if you're in a pinch. Other than that, you can find uh, those little stands at grocery stores uh, and other shops, and uh, you can get them out there. But that's, if you're just walking, that's probably the easiest place. There's also uh, little information boards that looks like things are posted on it, kind of like where they post uh, lost and found, reward. You can find them there as well. It's the easiest place when you're walking. It'll be those bus stops. You're welcome. Very welcome. Now, the compass, different story. I've only found one compass. And this is uh, two weeks in on this, this play. Drop some of this meat off. And uh, come back and get the rest of my parts. Now is the time to see whether it, if the meat... Uh, what it takes if it gets rancid or spoiled so let's go ahead and let's just throw some meat uh oops it's a little bit longer than a can to make what's going on unit i generally don't give out the my server information meat cooked meat It'd be different if it was a PvE game or something, but uh, it's a PvP game. It's just firmly in effect right now, so uh, don't really care for the stream sniping. Whether you was gonna do that or not, not saying you would, not saying you would, but uh, just for my protection and for my gameplay, I'd just uh, rather not tell you exactly which one I'm playing on. Where's that food? Let's see. Deer meat cooked. Let's see what it gives us. 
What's up, Augie Monstrosity? The Augmeister is in the house. That's what I've been waiting for. Well, let's see if it's worth it anymore. It is definitely worth it. Let me tell you. Uh, I wouldn't say worth it anymore. Compared to what it was, what it was wasn't worth buying in the beginning. It was worth getting on, testing it, uh, giving feedback uh, to the devs, letting them know what was going on. And they've taken a long span of time to actually put a lot of work into this game. Fully optimized and, oh man, it runs good. What's going on, Augman? I'll give monstrosity in the house, everybody. All right, so the deer meat's where it's at. Deer meat is where it's at. So let's go ahead and let's cook it instead of having a uh, rancid deer meat. I don't, I don't want it to spoil. So maybe if I cook it, it'll actually stay good for longer. Question, can you open the garage door and bring the car in? Oh, brother, brother, brother. Let me show you something right quick. Let's take this jerry can, okay? Smack a little fuel in this bad boy. Look what all, I found the pull start carburetor and the spark plug. Let's turn this little generator on Brr, Got my breaker panel got my circuit breaker zone Not only that look I like this place up my warehouse is legit son Got these boarded up got locks on the doors What you think? So we're in the hunt right now for an RV. Car right here. This is just my my, my shit around car. So dude, that must be like acid range. You guys see that? See how my health was going down? I ain't gonna take a chance. But uh, yeah, we're gonna get the RV. We're gonna park that bad boy in here. Yeah, that's that, that's probably the best feature, man. I'm, I'm loving. It. That's why I wanted the warehouse, man. I'm telling you. Not only, I mean, you got see these lights, uh, fluorescent lights fixer. I don't know if do I have a bulb in it. Yeah, I gotta find some bulbs uh, for these fluorescent lights. But I do have my office. Um, my office lights are working pretty good. That's for the fluorescent light, but you can turn these on and off. So I've got bulbs on these guys. So I just need to get some uh, and the fans coming soon So you'll be able to cool yourself off a little bit. They have a right here. Oh Shit, what's going on? I don't know why I was just randomly taking damage Dehydrated healthy. Oh shit. It's nighttime. We got to hydrate or our health uh, will either stay stay the same or decrease so Glad I looked at that. That's uh Oh shit. Burn the meat, damn it. We burn the meat. Brick. <laughs> I took my whole dead gun. Alright, let's settle down now. Settle down. Simmer down now. Simmer down. Alright. We got hydrated. Let's get back to what we had a campfire grill. Totally screwed the pooch on that one, didn't I? All right, burnt meat. Mmm. You know what? We're just gonna drop the burnt meat, which is a bummer. But it it showed over here that you have a ten percent. Uh, you have a ten percent chance of getting uh getting sick so trying to cook this meat up hopefully uh you may have learned a couple things from the video that's what i mean i'm here for knowledge and entertainment can't say i know it all but i can get you started you know what i'm saying brother i can get you started Dead gummit. It's twice. It's all good, man. I feel